Hi, my name is Sophia. I'm in 11th grade and I play the violin. This is what it sounds like. One thing that I like about playing the violin is that you get to learn a bunch of new music and you get to learn how to read music, which is something not everybody knows how to do. And um, something you can look forward to is by the time you get really good at reading music, you can start playing songs you like for movies and songs you like on the radio and other cool stuff like that. Hi everyone, my name is Milena and I'm here to show you the viola. And it's part of the string family, as you can see by these lovely strings. I know what you're thinking, it kind of looks like a violin, right? Actually, it's a bit bigger than the violin and it plays lower notes than the violin, so... That's a pretty low note. Violins can't play that. Now, to play it, we have this thing called a shoulder rest. So you can take it off, and it has this curve right here. So you can put it on your shoulder and play it comfortably, because you don't want to be playing on this wood. So you put it on, and then you rest it right on your shoulder, and you put your cheek or your chin in this chin rest right here. Right here. Like that. And I can hold it with no hands. but. And you can play it in different styles, like pizzicato, which is basically just plucking the strings, like... Which is really cool. And you can play it arco, or with the bow. So you go... Which is also very cool. Violas can play melodies, which is basically the main part that you hear. It can play harmonies, which is basically mixing with the parts, and it can play rhythms, which other parts can play off of. It's a really awesome instrument, and this is one of my favorite pieces that we're currently playing called Cinema Paradiso. So here we go. As you can hear, the low notes sound really good on a viola because of its bigger shape. Hi everyone, my name is Angeline and I am a senior at the high school. I wanted to show you one of my favorite instruments, the cello. I have been playing the cello and singing since fourth grade and have loved every minute. One of the main reasons I love being involved in our music program is because I love getting to work with amazing teachers and I get to play music with some of my best friends every day. I am also in the chamber orchestra and vocal ensemble at our high school. So through those programs, I get to play a little bit more advanced music after school once a week, in addition to getting to play every day, which is something I think is super fun. I've also been able to go to county and statewide festivals where I get to meet musicians from all different schools, and we got to share the same passion we have for music together, so that is something that you could look forward to in the future. So now I wanted to play a quick song that you might recognize. It's from one of my favorite musicals. It's called Defying Gravity from Wicked. I hope you enjoyed that song, and I really want to encourage you to explore music and try to play, sing, or even listen to it as much as possible, because I think it is an amazing gift. Bye! Hi! My name is Shay, and I play the bass. Um, this is the bass, and it's the biggest instrument in the orchestra, which means you can play the lowest strings. Um, so with the bass, you could either pluck or bow. I'm going to show you, like, this piece of me bowing. me bowing and this is with me plucking.
really enjoy playing the bass and I hope you try it out too. Hi guys, my name is Caitlin and I'm a junior up at the high school and I play the flute. Um, I'm going to play something for you guys that I think some of you might be able to recognize. <laughs> Basically, being a part of band is really special to me and it's a great way to make new friends and play some fun music and there's a bunch of musical opportunities up at the high school. Um, you could join marching band, you could be in the pit orchestra which is basically like the little orchestra underneath the musical. There's a spring musical every year um, and there's a lot of other fun stuff that comes with being in band so I think it would be a great opportunity for you guys to reach out and get involved while joining high school. Hi, um, my name is Jen, and I'm a junior here at Harbor Shields High School, and I play the clarinet. It looks like this. It's pretty long and slim, and has a lot of keys, and it looks scary, but it's not. Um, once you learn how to play it, these all come second nature, kind of. So it looks daunting, but I promise you it's pretty easy once you get the hang of it. Um, and you meet so many incredible people. All the teachers and staff members in our music program are so supportive and they just wanna see you grow. So I think that's one incredible thing because you can totally tell that the teachers that are teaching these programs really care about the students and they want to, them to, to see them get better. And another thing, which is kind of a bonus, um, is the people I met. I met so many incredible people throughout um, the music programs that our high school and middle school have to offer. And I think that's a beautiful thing. Like I said before, I play the clarinet. And um, in order for you guys to hear what it sounds like, I'm gonna play a portion of a song that you probably recognize from um, one of Disney's princess movies. And you're gonna guess in your head um, which movie this is from. So here I go. My name is Ty, I play the alto saxophone in the band, and I am a senior this year. All of you have so much to be excited about if you choose to get involved in the music program. Especially once you get to the high school, um, there are a lot of great groups you can get involved in, both in school and out of school. So whether you're in band or orchestra or chorus, there's a group for you. I'm a member of the in-school band, but I'm also a member of the jazz band and the marching band outside of school. So that means I get to play a lot of music, make a lot of memories, and surround myself with amazing people. Because I find that music kids are some of the nicest people I've met. And I've made a lot of my closest friends that way. So if you're thinking about joining one of the performing groups, definitely do it. Uh, it it's so worth it, I promise you. So now I'll give you a little taste of what the saxophone can sound like if you stick with it. Hello, I'm Victoria Bell. I'm a senior at Harvard High School, and I play the trumpet. And I love playing trumpet. Um, ever since fourth grade, I've been playing. And then, yeah, so in elementary school and middle school, it's a lot of fun being in band. And then as you get older, you have so many opportunities to do all sorts of different things. Um, you have Nisma, you have Scamia, you can play in all county bands. Uh, my favorite stuff has been 
marching band and jazz band, which started at the end of middle school. Um, and yeah, it can take you like to a lot of different places playing an instrument. Um, there's a lot of things to do, and it's so much fun being part of a band. And even just like practicing alone can be a lot of fun playing what kind of music you like. Um, yeah, and I will play something for you so you can hear what this sounds like. Okay, so this is from Star Wars. Maybe you guys know it. Um, so I'm going to play you guys a song called Military Medley, and you'll even play it in middle school. <laughs> Hi, my name is Dylan. I'm a 12th grader at the high school and I play the trombone. So trombone is a brass instrument, but it has a slide. So you can make really cool noises like this. That's pretty cool. Um, so I've been playing the trombone since fourth grade and now I'm a part of regular band, I'm part of marching band and jazz band. Um, so I really love playing this instrument. It's brought me a lot of great things. I've learned a lot about music, um, which is great. Playing music, listening to music. Um, and also I've made a lot of new friends through marching band, jazz band, and just being around other people who love music. So overall, I think band is a great program and I'm so glad I've been a part of it and that I've been able to play the trombone. All right, what's up? My name is Thomas Walden. I'm a senior in high school right now, and my instrument is the euphonium, also known as the baritone. So uh, I know that most of you have probably never heard of what a baritone is before. I know that I had no idea what it was when I was in fourth grade, but don't let that scare you away. Uh, it's not like it's some weird instrument some that's going to have some strange or different sound. Um, I mean, just look at it. It's got valves, just like a trumpet. It's got a mouthpiece like all the other brass instruments. And uh, so uh, let me show you a little bit of what it sounds like. a little piece of what it sounds like. I hope it shows you that it's not all about, all about high notes or low notes like the trumpet or the tuba or something like that. It can really play everything in between, which means you're not gonna really going to be missing out by picking an instrument like this over the trumpet or over the tuba. So yeah, there you go. Um, I hope you join band because it really is a family that's going to be with you for the rest of your life. It's not just about making beautiful music. It's about meeting new people, making new friends. And yeah, it's a family and I hope you join. Hi. I'm Jules Ramos of 8th grade and I play the tuba in band. Uh, I was told to make like a promotional video, so here I am. You know, just join it. It's fun. You get to practice an instrument, like a skill for later in life. Uh, who knows where it'll get you. So I'll play you a scale right now. <laughs> pretty easy. You guys can learn the same thing if you just join band. Hi everyone, my name is Hannah Prose and I'm a senior at the high school and I'm in the percussion section. Today I have the bell set with me, which is one of the many mallet instruments that I get to play. Here's the mallets that you use and I'm going to play a quick song so you can hear what it sounds like.
I love being a part of the percussion section because there's so many different instruments you get to play. Some of my favorites are the snare drum and the bass drum and the chimes. And I think it's really important for you to be a part of the high school music program because of all of the different people you're going to meet. I met some of my best friends in the high school music program and you get a ton of experience doing volunteer work that you can help out your community with. And my favorite part about the high school music program is that if you join the marching band, the kick line, or the vocal ensemble, you get to go to Disney World when you get to high school. So I hope all of you join the high school music program so that way you won't miss out on the fun when you get to high school.